We we'll celebrate joining the Rockman team. Uh, I've decided that it would be uh, very fitting to uh, present a challenge. Uh, I'm going to do it myself and I would like to encourage you to try it as well. It's a press up challenge. Now, uh, the funny thing about this is actually a three minute challenge and you only have to do one press up. So yeah, it sounds easy enough. Give it a go if you like and let me know in the comment section how you get on. Uh, feel free to post a video of it as well. If you do, make sure you're tagging me in that post. So the way this challenge is going to work then is I'm going to adopt the press up position. So my arms are going to be out straight. I'm going to set a timer for one minute after that minute has passed, I'm going to lower myself down to the bottom part of the pressure position. We're going to hold that as well, again, for one minute. After that one minute has passed, so I'm now at two minutes. I'm going to extend my arms so that I am in the halfway pressure position. Hold it there for one minute, and then after that minute is up, fully extend the arms to complete the one presser in three minutes. Ideally, you should do it on a flat slope, flat, flat surface. I'm doing it on a bit of an incline, as you can see there's a little bit of a hill behind me, so it's actually going to make it a little bit harder for me. I'll probably regret that a little bit later on. I'm going to tuck my t-shirt in as well, so that you can see that I'm not cheating by resting my belly on the floor. So, I think what's going to help with this one is focusing on the breathing and what I should have done really was check the floor because it's a bit, uh, a bit uneven in, the, in, in that respect. Focus on the breathing. Now, try and with this challenge, I want to try and maintain the position. I don't want to sort of stick my bum in the air or take hands off the floor, but um, I'll stay as still as you can. I'm going to try and stay as still as I can. It sounds easier now because I'm only a uh, third of the way through it. So I'm going to move into the bottom position. Hold it there. So, first position is fairly easy, second position is a little bit harder, and then the final position, which um, is going to be the middle, is going to be the hardest one, and I think that's where it's going to be make or break. So, 20 seconds left in this, or 23 seconds left in this position. Breathe in, nice and controlled, and then is when the real battle begins for the final bit. Here we go. Halfway up. So, uh, <laughs> I actually just sweated on my phone. And <laughs> the sweat actually got rid of the timer. So I couldn't see how much longer I had left. So the key with this, I was to try and keep the upper arm perpendicular to the floor. Um, difficult without using a mirror, I will admit. But you got to try and gauge off it as best you can. You'll know when you feel it because you get the maximum tension in the triceps. And at this point now, just keep breathing. Nice and controlled in through your nose. And then out through the mouth. Try not to focus on the time because you'll uh, drive yourself loop if you do that. And try not to let yourself slip down because I've lost the timer. I've got no idea where I am. <clears throat> That's not good. So the key to this is don't put the phone directly below you. Oh, we go. Oh. So challenge complete, and if you're going to be doing that, learn from my mistakes. Don't have the timer directly <laughs> beneath your face because your sweat on a hot day like this, your sweat will land on the screen and you'll actually lose your timer and you'll have no idea where you are. Luckily, I'd set it to a, to a beep and <laughs> let me know when a three minute point had been reached. 
Otherwise, I was just going to count 30 seconds in my head because I knew the last time I saw was 30 seconds. So I knew I was approaching the end. And if you're looking for a good workout, you need to check out this video. I'll put the link above. A 30 minute workout it can be done pretty much anywhere. If you give the challenge a go, good luck. Thank you very much for watching. Let me know in the comment section if you do it and how you get on. And I'd like to take this time now to thank Rockman for inviting me to join the team, the many challenges to come, and also the positive benefits that we will get from those challenges. I'll keep you all in the loop. You can follow my adventures. See you soon. Bye bye.